Jack Draper booked a place in the last eight of the Cincinnati Open as he came from behind to beat Canada's Felix Auger Eliasim 5-7-6 for 6-4, in a match that ended in bizarre and contentious circumstances. It is a third successive three-set victory for Draper, who will now meet Danish 15th seed Holger Rune in the quarterfinals. Auger Eliasim had already beaten number 7 seed Kasper Rude 6-3. 6-1 earlier in the day after rain prevented them taking to the court on Thursday night. However, he showed no signs of tiredness in the first set, seizing on his only break point in the 12th game. It was the only break point the Canadian had throughout the match as Draper fought back to claim victory. The match ended in controversy, however, with Augur Eliasson furious that Draper's shot that ended the match was not legitimate. The Briton advanced for a drop shot but his opponent was left incensed, with the ball appearing to have deflected from Draper's racket frame onto the floor before looping high end over the net via the court. Draper claimed he was watching Agur Eliasim rather than the ball at the point of impact, adding, I would replay it, if there was a replay I would replay it, which cut little mustard with the Canadian. He told the umpire, Gregory Allensworth, you're going to get out now and then it's going to go everywhere, and it's going to look ridiculous, I'm serious, it's going to look ridiculous. The British player told the umpire, I might look like an idiot now because people say I'm not being fair. But I was looking at him. The supervisor was subsequently called, but had no grounds to overturn the decision, with Draper unwilling to give up the point without outside confirmation that the call was incorrect. With no video replay available to the officials, the decision was then left to the umpire. Allensworth told Agur Eliasim, I just have to call it how I saw it. If I had a doubt, I would tell you but listen, we can go back and look at it after the match and if I see I'm wrong, I'll admit it to you. But for now, I can't go back and look at it. The players embraced at the net as the final result was confirmed. Rain had forced the players off on Thursday night with Alcara as a setup but 3-1 down and a second set tiebreak. Monfils was quickly out of the blocks to level the contest, and he then took the decider for a 4-6, 7-6-5, 6-4 to four triumph. Third seed Alexander Zverev reached the quarterfinals with a 7-5, 7-6-6 victory over Spain's Pablo Carrego Busta. Andriy Rublev enjoyed a comfortable passage to the last eight, defeating American Brandon Nakashima 7-6-5, 6-1.